In this section we're going to build our symbol library and this has been happening for quite a while in our system but you can do it with yours and also perhaps if you're uh, aligned with our uh, Dropbox files you can pull down some of the symbols that we have and start adding your own as we share our cooperative illustrator services. Um, so one of the things that we're doing when we're on here is working with our symbol library. Now you can see that I've added the trees to this library. Uh, this is for the file on this project and uh, we're working um, on the entire project right now adding the tree list and then we'll add the symbol list. So these symbols are actually pre-made and we have these on a separate piece of artwork in Illustrator and we'll open that up now and we have this under our AI design tools and so we can see all these libraries that we have here so we have a, a tree symbol library plant symbols which was our original symbol library which is rather large and then we broke it down as it got bigger into trees shrubs small trees perennials and such and so right now I'll open up the tree library and this comes from the plant database Excel spreadsheet and it looks pretty utilitarian and it is everything we do is in 20 scale one inch equals 20 feet actually that should be an inch symbol there um, and so we're common with all of our symbols that way also all the symbols have um, initials for their scientific name and this is as much for for me as for anybody else is is just trying to remember the scientific names for the plants more and more uh, get away from the common names and try to really memorize the scientific names as much as possible so on here we have the scientific names that start with a b of the initials anyway and then in the upper left corner we just have them already sized from one foot across to sixty feet across this is the spread uh, with that and then with the initials in it so when I have a tree that I want to add to this like in this case um, on this project I was going to add uh, black willow what else did I have here and Swiss stone pine um, the black willow is 40 feet across and so I would go to the 40 foot symbol here use my tool that is actually a salix and I'm gonna oops I'm going to take the whole thing. Here we go. Yeah, lots of things going on here. Weird. I don't know why that's happening. Oh, I see. Grab the letters. That's why. So I'm going to grab this whole thing. Push down the Option key to duplicate it. And it's a Salix. So we're going to bring it down here. and then we'll press the Z key, zoom in, and we're going to change this plant now. 